one two four here, and today I'm going to show you how to install the Minions mod for 1.2.5 Mac only. So what you're going to need for this mod is Mod Loader, Mod Loader MP, and of course the Minions mod. So once you have those where you want them, whether it's your desktop or in the downloads folder, you're just going to go to um, you're going to go to your Finder, then you're going to go to your name, then Library, Application Support, and find your Minecraft folder. You may have to scroll down, but mine is already there. So You'll end up with this, with bin, saves, and everything. So, you want to back up your saves always. And if you don't have a clean Minecraft folder, and you and if you don't know how to do that, then it, you're going to delete everything in it, except for your saves, log into Minecraft, and just re-download the packages. It'll automatically do that. Or you can just go to Options when you're in Minecraft. So I'll show you right now. You can just go to Options, and you just go to Force Update. Or you just log in again, and it will download packages automatically. So once that's done, you're going to go into your bin, and you're going to right-click um, on the Minecraft.jar, and you're going to go open with Archive Utility. Then you're going to delete the coffee cup, or you can rename it, so it does not conflict with what you're going to add, and what you're going to add is .jar on the end of the Minecraft folder. So it should now say Minecraft.jar, and once that's done, you can go into the folder, and you're gonna range by kind, and once that's, and then you'll see that the meta INF pops up, and if you're on lion, then you just can just search for it. But if you're on leopard like me, just do that, and it's much easier, and just delete the meta INF. So then you're gonna open up Mod Loader, and you're gonna select everything in Mod Loader, and you're gonna copy and paste them into Minecraft.jar and I'll apply to all, replace. Do the exact same thing with Mod Loader MP. Now, I'll be right back because um, you need the mods folder in your Minecraft folder to install the Minions mod. Um, so go ahead and open up Minecraft and I'll be right back when that's done. Guys, I'm back and Minecraft has loaded up. So then you can go ahead and exit out. And when you go back to your Minecraft folder, you should see that there it creates a mods folder. So you're going to go into that, and now you're going to go into the Minions mod, and don't worry about anything in it, just worry about the client. So go into the client folder, and go to put in Minecraft folder. Then you'll notice that there's mods and resources. You're going to go to the mods one first, and you're just going to copy these two, the zip and the config, into the mods folder in your Minecraft. And you're going to go back and back into um, the Minions mod here, the client, and you're going to go into the resources, and the same thing in your Minecraft folder. Resources, and because there is no mods folder in the resources, you're, you can just copy this one into the resources in your Minecraft. So, for purposes of this mod, um, so I can show you that it does work, I'm going to install too many items, and the way to do that is you just go back to your Minecraft.jar, so um, go, in, go into your bin, and then go into your Minecraft.jar and then go ahead and open up too many items copy it paste co um, sorry copy and paste into minecraft.jar and then go ahead and open up minecraft and I'll be back when that is finished lo um, loading guys I'm back and minecraft has finished loading so if I go into single player and I can show you that it works and if I go into my inventory you can see that too many items is working and if I keep going then one item has been implemented, and that is the master's staff. So it shows that it does work. And I hope you guys enjoyed. So don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And thank you guys for watching, and have a nice day.